Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what are the steps to generate a report in Cucumber projects? Let me answer. In Cucumber projects, we create a class known as a test runner class. In the test runner class, we provide one annotation known as at the rate cucumber options annotation. Under this annotation, we'll provide a property known as plugin property. To this plugin property, we specify the HTML report details. Like uh, HTML is the type of the report, colon, under where the report need to be generated. This is the location where the report need to be generated and with what name and with what extension. Okay, like this we'll provide. Let me practically demonstrate to you so that you will understand it very well. So I'll switch to this uh, Eclipse ID where we have this uh, sample Cucumber framework for project. In that, we have this test runner class. This test runner class contains an annotation known as Cucumber options. Okay, in order to generate a report in Cucumber projects, in test runner class, we specify this Cucumber options annotation. Under this Cucumber options annotation, we specify different properties like features property, glue property. Like that, one more property we provide is plugin property. Okay, there is a property known as plugin. To this plugin property, we specify the details of the report, Cucumber report to be generated. First of all, here we are specifying which type of report. It's a HTML type of report. Okay, here we have to mention HTML. To this plugin property of this Cucumber options of this test runner class in Cucumber project, we specify the type of the property that is HTML and where exactly the report need to be generated. This is a location where, okay, under this project, where exactly at which location the Cucumber report in HTML format should be generated under the target folder. Where is the target folder? This is the target folder. Okay, under the target folder, under the project, under the target folder, under this folder, under the target folder with this name, you can give any name for this. I just gave Cucumber reports as a folder name. We expand this, you see, you got a Cucumber reports. Already have run this, so already it got generated. Cucumber reports folder under the Cucumber reports folder with the name known as Cucumber report and the extension known as HTML, a Cucumber report will be generated. Okay, when you run the scripts using test runner class. So this is a location with this extension and name with HTML format, a Cucumber report will be generated. Okay, this is a Cucumber report. I'll show you how it looks like open with the browser. This is a Cucumber report which uh, got uh, generated earlier itself i'm just showing okay so this is a cucumber report this is how it looks like guys okay so these are the steps these are the steps to generate a report in cucumber projects fine so in the test runner class under the cucumber options at the rate cucumber options annotation we can provide different properties one of the property that we can provide is plugin like this to that property we can specify different uh, values okay pretty is one value this is not related to report anyhow the second second value is related to the report cucumber html report okay so type of the report and the location of the report with the name and extension okay we can specify like this to generate a report in cucumber projects so that's all for this session thank you bye bye